because of the metro. If you didn't help me cross the invisible hurdles, didn't warn me of the mysterious dangers, my journey would have ended long ago. It's no wonder that I believed in him and told him my story. I have so many questions for him, and he seems to have all the answers. Okay, I was missing one of the, uh... One of the notes. Oh no, I didn't find the safe last time. I found the key, but I didn't see the safe in the corner. That's what it was. I'm a mute protagonist. Kind of sucks to be them. Led me into cursed station. The name was no accident. Its people were locked in an endless war for survival. Yep. This part's gonna be annoying as shit. The station is under attack again. Let's go, lad. The defenders could use some help. Yeah. God, over here. The annoying part about this. They took out the machine gun. So... Demolition crew is here. Jiggle, jiggle. Luckily, Artyom can sprint and jump while reloading. Guys, guys, guys. I have a hell storm of death following me. Do me a favor and get those fuckers off my ass. Really appreciate that. That should have blocked that part off. You need to throw a grenade up there. Fuck. <sighs> that leaves this bit. Go fight, uh, okay, quick, 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 engage in vulnerability cutscene. Yes, hello. I'm not going to inject myself with drugs while I sprint away from you. And reload my shotgun. And get the fuck off the train tracks. Because... I win, motherfucker. And I have full health. And you're an asshole. 
And ghosts are guarding that. Oh no, I have to actually plant it. Oh shit. I thought you just had a chucking grenade over there. My bad. I forgot it did some stuff. Okay, Khan's broken away from the group, so the objective's complete now. I'm gonna go see what's down here though. Might be some dead people with some goodies. Look at that man, he has stuff. Unfortunately, I have a silenced pistol. Much as I love having the re extended barrel on the revolver. You... Whatever. And then you just cast your spell of plot convenience to move everybody out of my way. I'm guessing that guy probably tried to run through here and the ghosts were like, no, fuck you. So... People. Ooh. It won't let me put them out. That's it. Get in. Uh, I'm not done de dis you know, disrespecting these dead people. Ah, I've been plotted! Any gold? Well, you look human. <laughs> the 
<clears throat> Free station, eh? Careful, kid. Our free station is under the watchful eye of the Reds. Paranoia is the new game in town, so keep yourself below the radar. You understand? Mm-hmm. Yoink. Go to hell. Get lost. Face to the wall. This is an inspection. Hey, come on. Quit harassing me. I don't swing that way. <laughs> Move it, boy. Got the bullshit. Prepare for inspection. I'm always prepared for this. Uh, doctor, could you check my prostate while you're at it? I'm pissing kind of funny. It's glowing. Must be the radiation, huh? <laughs> you freak. The fuck? Now, so, you keep the part that attracts you the most? <laughs> oh. Uh, you have a grenade launcher. What, they don't feed you enough? <laughs> or is that a shotgun? Uh, it looks like a grenade launcher. Guys. I want your gun. Oh, okay, that one was better, but I still think my grandmother could take you. <laughs> Let's bring him in. We'll see how his jokes sound at you, Bian. Shh, hush. And who are you, the comedian's boyfriend? Put your hands up. You're under arrest. Uh, why? Oh wait, I forgot, you're commies. Alright, alright! Lay off! Ugh. I'll come quietly. Let's get them! Come on, follow me! Beep. Dun 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 Beep beep beep. Boop boop boop. Hi! You guys are wasting ammo, you know. No, oh, he's fucked. By the power of plot, I jump! by Han's friend, Andrew the Blacksmith. He would prove to be my ticket out of the communist station. He looks like an old man now. But the only way goes through a goddamn battlefield. The front line. There are many in the Metro who hate the Reds, because they're afraid of them. The Reds always go hungry, even though they work around the clock. They're told they toil for a better future, but year after year their lives get even more miserable. They fight with abandon, as if not afraid of death at all, and their commanders just throw them away, piling their bodies up to block enemy gun emplacements, spending their lives as if their charges were immortal. But they are mortal, and they die, of exhaustion, of overworking, of bullets fired by their enemies, and of their own commissaries ordered to shoot those retreating. And they are told that they are superior, that they are made of steel, not flesh, and that is why I pity them. What do they live and die for? The idols of the past are long gone, but they are kept in dark about it. The slogans they communicate with are meaningless in the new world. They are prohibited from speaking or even thinking freely. Anyone asking questions is deemed a traitor. Anyone whose life, who says life is better outside of the red line is a spy and a saboteur. You have to hide everything human about you and become like the rest of them. But there are also people like Andrew the Blacksmith here. 
People who refuse to abandon hope and who persevere. If I were in his shoes, I'd be long gone. Why is he still here? Is he afraid of being shot and making his escape? Fine, between the Reich and the Reds. You'll need a disguise. Take these overalls, put them over your clothes. The Reds are rounding up the volunteers to storm the Nazi fortifications. They're about to send a train full of new recruits straight into the fire. But you will be riding the train unannounced. Your seat won't be first class, but you don't have to pay the fare with your own blood either. <laughs> Once the troop train has passed the roadblocks, you're on your own. So... Drunk fuck. Hmm. Get lost. Fuck you. I'm protagonist. I have the power of chuck points. You don't mind if I take these, do you? So if I remember right, I th think there's actually a new weapon available here that wasn't in the original, uh, well, in the original American release I had. Authorized, go fuck yourself. That thing. Oh, fuck. 210? Shit. Hi, how are you? Oh, wait, yeah, there's no armor in this one to buy. Uh, kind of a... Hell breath. The railgun shoots ball shoots bearing balls at incredible speed, but takes time to charge this capacitor. It deals lower damage if fired before charging fully. Fuck it. Oh. Four X scope, huh? Yeah, that ain't gonna work. So You're welcome. I hope this gun doesn't suck. After I look for loots, because I just spent like almost all my fucking money on. Yeah. Okay, okay. I hope this gun doesn't suck. I was not wrong about Andrew, I just grossly underestimated him. He's not afraid of running, he just does things that would take much more guts than that. Andrew helps others escape the red line, risking his own life every minute. He and his friends saved lots of refugees using a network of abandoned passages and forgotten tunnels, which the Reds are still ignorant about.